Throughout the United States, on our roads and highways, there's a dangerous hazard hidden in plain view. You're on the highway, and a large tractor trailer pulls up next to you. You get kind of nervous. But have you ever wondered what might happen if your car and the truck collided? It happens every day. It's called truck underride. A passenger car crashes into and under the rear of a large tractor trailer. The taller structure of the trailer rips through the windshield, tears the roof, and penetrates into the passenger compartment, causing severe to fatal injuries to the occupants. For decades, trailers had ineffective rear guards. Close to 300 people were killed each year in accidents like these, and hundreds more suffered severe and permanent injuries. They were paralyzed or brain damaged. But starting in 1998, the government began requiring that new trailers install safer rear guards that were lower, wider, and stronger. These rear underride guards effectively stop cars from going under the rear of a trailer, preventing deaths and injuries. This is one of those rear underride guards. You'll see them on trucks and trailers all across the country. And as you saw, they're pretty effective at preventing a car from going under the rear of a trailer. But what about the side of a trailer? Without similar guards along the side, can a car still go under? To this day, there is nothing along the sides of trailers to prevent cars from crashing underneath. Approximately 226 people die each year when their car goes under the side of a trailer. Hundreds more suffer severe injuries. Over 4 million trailers travel on U.S. roads, but none of them has protection along the side to prevent underride. The government and trucking industry are ignoring the hazard. Can something be done to prevent side underride? Just like a guard used on the rear of a trailer to prevent underride, can't guards also be installed along the sides of trailers for protection? In 2001, while traveling in Europe, I noticed these long panels along the sides of their tractor trailers. I learned that trailers throughout Europe and Asia use these guards to protect pedestrians and bicyclists. They also help prevent cars from going under the sides. With side underride guards, a car is deflected away from the side of a trailer. Underride is prevented, the passenger compartment is maintained. In Europe, the passengers walk away from side underride accidents. So why don't we in the U.S. get the protection of side underride guards on our trailers? Well, until the government and industry adopt higher standards, the deaths and injuries will continue.